गुड मॉर्निंग माय डियर स्टूडेंट टुडे इज फ्राइडे दिसंबर 22 2017 एंड आई एम प्रेजेंटिंग यू द न्यूज़ पेपर एनालिसिस ऑफ द हिंदू द फ्रंट पेज न्यूज दैट अट्रैक्ट्स माय अटेंशन ऑन एवरीबॉडीज अटेंशन दैट इज द ए राजा कनिमोची ऑल अदर एक्यूज्ड एक्यूटेड इन 2G केस 2G केस एंड हियर इज no evidence the court has told that no evidence on record the cbi court i am telling you cbi is having the investigation also and cbi is having a court also the cbi the in, in after investigation the cbi produces with evidence the case to the court and in the court the court decides that uh, what will happen based on the uh, trial and all the uh, all the procedures so no evidence on record to prove corruption court found money laundering charges against them said a special court in delhi uh, on this uh, in this context one editorial is also there let us try to understand what is the 2g spectrum first thing and what was the case in briefly we have to understand and we know very well that 2g is usually get, getting phasing out at present 2g spectrum 2G was a second generation cell technology. Second generation, okay? Cell technology, that is mobile technology, cellular technology. We know that there are the different cells on which any town is being divided, and in each cell there is a cell address. And as you move along, uh, along with the cell, on this tower, this tower, this tower, then the connection moves also. it is a second generation cellular technology it was commercially launched on the gsm standard gsm standard uh, in 1991 the primary benefit of the 2g network over their other predecessors over their predecessors were that the phone conversations were digitally encrypted digital encryption was there this was the important aspect uh, encrypted and we know that there are different wavelength which could be allotted for that one <laughs> before 2g there was the 1g and here in the 1g this one the, at that time the mobile technology was analog it was analog but now it was the with the 2g it was to be digital it was digitally encrypted and with this we could send the text message mms also multimedia message the picture message etc all those things so this was in demand at that time this was the importance at that time and what was the real evidence which was produced by the cbi after investigation and what was the real thing came in newspaper it all happened in 2008 much before at that time the earlier upa government the united progressive alliance means congress government was there what i what was there that is there was a the policy of the first come first serve what was the policy first come first serve and what was happening that it was introduced the this policy was introduced at the time of the earlier government even at the time of the atal bihari bajpayee but at the time of implementation on the perhaps 10th january 2008 the companies were given only a few hours time Uh, to supply the letter of intent and the payments etc means first come first serve all the companies were earlier tipped off they were told that okay you just come and within very short time were being given and the money of that one was used to in fact for a certain other company to help in that way because they, they have taken the company which has been which has got the benefit they they took the loan from the bank at the rate of 14% and invested that one to somewhere at the rate of 5% only so why this company had made this much of sacrifice it was alleged that it was to help the telecom minister of that time and the group and the raja kan modi etc so this came in the news then in on the in the 2012 after that the supreme court of india ruled uh, on the public interest litigation related to 2g spectrum allocation and they have, they could find that yes there was a prima facie the case of this type of uh, nepotism had come in place so this was the main uh, case okay as you read the news here that which were 
there were three firms name is coming here in this paragraph this was the Xuan Technology te te Telecom Private Limited U Unitech Group companies and the, the non revision of the interference transfer of rupees 200 crore to Kalinga TV Private Limited as illegal gratifications now the point is that the CBI, the CBI court, the special CBI court, they have not found that type of the evidences which are required to substantiate the charges and to prove the charges in the court of law. So then Prime Minister now he has opened, uh, he has made the statement that propaganda had no foundation to respect the ruling Manmohan he has told that yes, the propaganda had been there, it has blown out of proportion, but you just see you are not getting. Now it is very important to go through the editorial aspect. The editorial is very pertinent, he is telling that a scam or folklore, whether it was a really a scam or whether it was only a propaganda. The 2G equital uh, call into question the political investigation narratives of the past decades, political investigations. Very interestingly, the, author, the editor is uh, starting the editorial that what is illegal uh, from the point of view of the administrative law, from the point of view of the administrative law that if the uh, administration, in the administration there is a uh, case of the preponderance of probability, what is important from the point of view of the administrative law may not necessarily be an offence from a criminal court's perspective. Let us try to understand. Very important statement that what is illegal, illegal from the point of view of the administrative law, because in the administrative law, in the administration, the probability chance is there, means yes, something must have been done, because the system was callous and there was lack of transparency and if somebody has benefit, some trails we are finding, so preponderance of probability. This is the important word for the administrative law, pro probability, probability. But in the case of the criminal proceedings, in the case of the rule of the land, the law of the land, when the proceedings are going on, at that time, the conviction has to be proved beyond reasonable doubt. Beyond reasonable doubt, no, beyond doubt. Means at least um, there, are, or there can always be acquittal on the basis of lack of evidences, which prove the doubt beyond any type of imagination. Means it has, it has to be proved. So beyond doubt, beyond doubt. Okay, that is the word, means here the conviction has to be proved, but here preponderance of probability is there. So from that perspective, if you analyze, the whole editorial aspects become very much clear to you that how the evidences could not be gathered, the trail were not established. It was only that, yes, this company got benefit, or this company got benefit. But why, what are the real trail? That is required to be understood that yes, whether the minister had given a real phone call or the tap tapping of the phone call was there. I mean, the, the various type of the evidences, which definitely for the first come first serve basis. At that time, what could have happened? It could have happened that somebody, some minister or somebody might mean, I am not very sure, that m might have called to some officers and the officers had helped. But in this case, the officer had been penalized because the, he is a government servant, preponderance of probability. And charges, etc. would have been filed and his case must be pending, his pension and gratuity would have been withheld. But uh, what about this one? Beyond doubt, I mean the, uh, the politicians, they were not in the part of the government, they are not the government officials, no. So here they had been acquittal. So my dear students, you all are civil servants, you must keep in mind this aspect. But because, because for you, the, your getting, I mean, punished is very high, rather you are be accused and charged seated and then proceedings going on administratively against you it is very high and you will be under tremendous pressure uh, a tremendous depression the stress and all those things but in the court of law it can be that you can be acquitted then it will be there but the, at that time the duress will would have been there besides in the at that time also in the news it, it had come it was 2g spectrum only no and 2g spectrum spectrum there was a zero loss Zero loss, rather it has helped the country because, the, what is the argument given in the court? It was zero loss because it helped the country, wow. 
बिकॉज दी द पर्सन गॉड द टू जी स्पेक्ट्रम लाइसेंस एट लेस प्राइस देन हुड हैव डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड हिज बेनिफिट टू द पब्लिक ओनली सो पब्लिक गॉड पब्लिक हैड टू पे लेस प्राइस फॉर दियर मोबाइल डाटा सो फ्रॉम दैट परस्पेक्टिव ऑल्सो दिस न्यूज इज गिविंग सम जस्टिफिकेशन ऑन पेज वन अगेन दिस न्यूज दैट सेवरल पॉल्यूशन लीड्स टू वार्निंग ऑफ एन सी आर स्टेट्स मेनी ट्रेन कैंसिल्ड रे स्केड्यूल्ड visibility fell to 40 meters they are telling that this type of the graph they are showing that above 400 it is the heavier then it is a very poor 300 to 400 this type of the aspects so air quality index in this respect there are some of the top things what is this air quality index that is very important that you have seen already let us revise it air quality index aqi that is the environmental and protection act is there no in they calculates the aqi environmental sorry aqi environmental protection act epa calculates the aqi for five major pollutants regulated by the clean air act these are the these are the five what are these these are the ground level ozone ground level ozone in climate classes we have seen this thing also in the pollution chapters there are the particle pollution that is the particulate matter particulate matter the ground water ozone particulate matter that is important 2.5 is more dangerous than the 10 then there are carbon monoxide sulfur dioxide and nitrogen dioxide my dear students please make a note of these things these five decides the concentration of this decides the air quality index and in the weather forecast here you just see here it is written that these are the these are the things which decides the air quality index and here it is written also that gaziabad at present is the most uh, having the heavier air quality index more than five, almost 500 so this from this perspective In cold Kashmir, Harisha spells warmth. That this news draws my attention. This in cold Kashmir. Here some of the word has been used. One is Harisha. Harisha is a preparation of the mutton. Uh, the mutton, boneless mutton, when it is mixed with the rice, uh, I mean flour, and boiled, and after that with certain uh, spices, good spices, it is being served hot. Then it is the Harisha preparation. This is Harisha preparation. Second aspect they have told about the Chilai Kalan. The forty days the cold Kashmir is the in the locally known as the Chilai Kalan. This why because it is related to some extent with the lifestyle and the culture. So from that aspect, it can be of little bit amusing for you, important for you. India votes for talk on Jerusalem. Yes, India has taken its traditional state on the Jerusalem. That is a welcome step. Otherwise, we have seen that with the national security strategy of the United States, it was prompting India to vote in favor of the USA. But anyhow, India has taken its stand. It is having its own stand. That is important. My dear students, human being, man, and elephant conflict. The elephant project. This is important. Revise your notes. Doctors still enter sixth day in Rajasthan. This news has come one day, two days before also. In this condition, sometimes the Essential Service Maintenance Act. This becomes important. Essential Service Maintenance Act means doctor. Doctor cannot go on a strike because it is covered under the Essential Service. But anyhow, the political consideration could have been given. But Essential Service Maintenance Act, as the district magistrate, is all powerful. For calling the services of the doctors for the other hospitals, even the private hospitals will be told that you have to treat the patients as per the essential services maintenance act in the in the case of emergency or in case of the exigency. GST work in progress, my dear students. This article has been written by the C. Rangarajan. C. Rangarajan is a former chairman to the Economic Advisory Council. To the Prime Minister and the former Governor of the RBI also, and M. Govind Rai was member fourteenth Finance Commission. So this article is worth for the preservation. Very important insights are there. They have talked about all the good good aspects insights of the GST. They have told the history of GST. That introduction of GST is an important reform and a standard policy recommendation for the structural adjustment programs. 
of the International Monetary Fund, a structural adjustment program. So this is an important insight that GST has come as a result of a structural adjustment programs of the International Monetary Fund. This has been a major money spinner and a source of productivity gain. And uh, GST was in one form or the other where in the 165 countries it was implemented and it is internationally well acclaimed process for the tax collection. And GST uh, taken over center stage in many countries and considered important in view of the competitive reduction in corporate tax rates. Competitive reduction in corporate tax rates. This is important word. So it was expected that there has to be reduction, competitive reduction in the all type of the corporate tax after the GST. But we are finding at present there are the four or five slabs. They are telling that there should be not more than two slabs and should brought down to the one slab. So this is very much important. Such type of the slabs should, uh, should come down. Reason is that at present there are the four tax rates are there and there are three rates of the shares are there. So in context of that, there should be there is requirement that GST council is there and a rule uh, GST council on which you have made a write up. If not, please revise it or or make it. It is important. Questions are expected from this aspect only. So the GST council see, they are they have to consider that there should be a fitment committee which should decide all those things. And all the states, some glitches are there. Unless these glitches are not solved, the cooperative federalism is not possible. First aspect, second aspect is that related to the petroleum, LPG, etc. They have to see. Earlier also we have seen about the e-way bill, that how e-way bill implementation is also problem, creating problems for the GST. The author is talking about such type of the curved edges required to be round, means it has to be made smooth and it takes some time, so nothing to worry. The second lead article is related to the Tamil people who have been historically living in the Sri Lanka and what type of the discriminations they are facing. We can empathize with them. Should adultery be a crime? The, to the last one you know very well about the IPC 497 and the, the adultery in that case. Uh, what are the provisions? The, nicely, it, uh, it has been summed that uh, summed up that yes, uh, it is discriminatory to some extent in nature. It is just giving me women are giving I mean women and man means their right to life and liberty. They have equated with this one. From that perspective, it is important. For a wider food basket, they are telling that okay, in the rural India, there is the global hunger index etc are very high and people, children are stunting. They are wasting. But what about in the urban India? Urban India, the basic uh, the BMI, uh, BMI is uh, going in favor of and people are becoming fatty and they are becoming uh, obese. The ladies are also. So we have to see that here there is no food crisis in India. So there is a rural urban divide. Uh, secondly, the author is talking on these lines only. Related to the overseas notes, they are telling that in the representation of the people act that um, the NRI, who are staying outside, they have made some PIL and they should be given the right to vote. But anyhow, in the Representation of People Act, it is there that person has to be there itself present at the time of casting vote. So from that perspective, this editorial required to be understood, this article required to be understood. So these are the important aspects. So my dear students, going from back, let us revise that we have seen these aspects in much some something in detail that overseas notes an amendment to allow in a right to vote by proxy means they, their vote definitely matters, but there are the representation of the people act and the amendment bill, etc. Unless the amendment is not being made, it is not feasible. Then regarding this one that for a wider food bas basket, it was related to the basal metabolic rate and basal metabolic index and this one the, in the rural urban divide. The, this editorial was related to this scam or folklore in these conditions we have seen that. Uh, the 2G spectrum, administrative justice and the criminal court of proceedings etc. The second editorial was related to the Austria and we have seen that in the Austria and European Union there is a tendency of going on for the rightist approach also that was the main editorial. Besides this one is very important preserve this article it is for the future reference also so that you can read it once or twice it will become clear to you. 
देन दिस मन द डॉक्टर स्टिल इंटर सिक्स डे इन राजस्थान एसेंशियल सर्विसेज मेंटेनेंस एक्ट आई हैव टोल्ड दैट एक्ट ऑफ पार्लियामेंट ऑफ इंडिया पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट बस सर्विस हेल्थ सर्विस हॉस्पिटल्स एक्सेट्रा दिस ऑल आर कवर्ड अंडर ई एस एम ए दिस एयर क्वालिटी इंडेक्स आई हैव टोल्ड दैट दे आर द फाइव टाइप ऑफ द पैरामीटर्स ऑन विच द एयर क्वालिटी इंडेक्स आर बींग जज बाई अंडर द इन्वायरमेंटल पॉल्यूशन दिस वन प्रिवेंशन एंड कंट्रोल अथॉरिटी दिस वन अंडर दिस एक्ट द ई पी सी ए इन्वायरमेंटल पॉल्यूशन कंट्रोल अथॉरिटी दे फाइंड एट दट आर द फाइव फैक्टर्स ऑन विच वी हैव डिस्कस्ड रिगार्डिंग हरीशा वी हैव टोल्ड दैट हरीशा इम्पॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम द कल्चरल पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू द इंडिया टेक्स वोट्स फॉर टॉक्स ऑन जेरूशलम दिस इज एन इम्पॉर्टेंट इंडिया टूक दिस स्टैंड सो वी आर फाइंडिंग दैट and ultimately we have seen the 2g scam air quality index harisha gst esma an amendment to rpa for forecasting vote by nri my dear students i think that now you are finding it much more easier for reading the news and analyzing it and to make it relevant for your civil services preparation within one hour because now dear students pt is coming fast you should not take more than 2 hours in reading the news paper not more than 2 hour at all including my class h on the some of the descriptions of the notes okay